while, we're going to go up here and work for the uh, Argent Crusade a little bit. Level 40, okay. So now it's wanting us to go to Eastern Plague Lands, and we will. Uh, wow, that's a really good uh, wrist item. See, I think that they're doing that because um, a lot of these are non-heirloom uh, slots. Um, so they're they're putting these in to uh, to kind of fill in your your slots that you're uh, missing. So if you are uh, leveling, ugh, ugh, I can't even talk. If you are leveling up uh, and you're starting something new, uh, definitely kind of keep an eye out for those. Um, kind of see what uh, what you can pick up and stuff. These spiders are all neutral for some reason. Uh, we're almost, uh, yeah, we're way over half like through again. Greetings. All right. Welcome to North Rand, or Northridge, Warlock. Yay. Light bless you. Uh, it's good to be back in Northridge. I've got my meal, my beautiful wife, a bouncing baby boy. I even put in my hat. I even put in my hat with the Argent Crusade. We'll be supplying Tyrion's forces with lumber. My lumberjacks are being exceptionally productive, too, up until the point when the spiders came. Now they refuse to go any deeper in the woods. Maybe you can help me out. Hop on one of my horses and use it to frighten those spiders. For the alliance. Can I help you? Kelly. Oh, she's got like a little baby back. Oh. I'm happy for Nathaniel. He spent so long trying to return to Northridge, and now with the Scarlet Crusade out of the way, he can finally move back home. It's just, even for a seemingly idyllic setting, it's not really the best place to raise a family. For example, along this valley's edge, you will find rabid foxes searching for innocent prey. Every once in a while, I catch a glimpse of one looking right at me. Please, Warlock, remove some of these foxes. I don't feel safe with them here. Very well. I can do that. <clears throat> so what you do is you come over and grab, jump on one of these horses. You notice that they kind of run away from you? Keep that in mind. Now let's kill some foxes. Feel a bit more relieved, thank you. Have a good one. Uh, farther to the south, you will find red pine knolls, a new arrival to the area. You probably passed some on your way here. Nathaniel pretends like they're not a problem, but I know better. I've seen them running away with our lumber last 
at night. I don't know what they're what they do with the lumber. They don't seem particularly handy, but that doesn't stop them from stealing it. Head down to their camps and steal that lumber back. Safe travels. I have my doubts about those gnolls intentions. They haven't attacked us yet, but their numbers are growing. They seem to always have their weapons ready. I'm no military expert, but that seems a little aggressive to me. Maybe if we took away some of their weapons, they would be a little less likely to pose a threat in our mill. Be careful. Well met. Well, it sounds like they're certainly afraid of the Mustang, but they're not leaving for good. I can't have you running around on a horse forever, nor do I think you'd want to. Fine. Bloodshed it is. The High Lord was generous enough to send some of his recruits to protect us here at the mill. With your horsemanship skills and their martial prowess, we can do away with this spider problem easily. Hop back on that Mustang and scare those spiders again, but this time scare them all the way up here to the mill. These Hearth Glen recruits will handle things from there. Spider Fryer. Careful. All right. So this, uh, I'll show the first part of this. Uh, wow, if there are any, um, and I'll get a couple of kills, but I'm not gonna make you guys watch all of it because it's it's kind of annoying. You gotta do 10 like that. Sometimes you can get like a whole bunch, but it's really hard to get uh, to get them all going in the same direction. Well, that wasn't as bad as I thought. I've I've chased those things right. around really a lot before. Uh, I'll go on and take that and see what it looks like. Oh, ding again. Ah, uh, before you go, Valene, I have a message for you. There's someone in Hearth Glen who'd like to meet you, meet with you. He says he's heard your name pop up a few times already. Consider yourself lucky, Valene. Not everyone gets a personal audience with High Lord Tyrion Forkring. Ooh. Go with honor, friend. Let's go kill some gnolls. Okay, I guess we technically don't have to kill them. I need to get 
a, a demon out. As you can see, it, it does not take very long to, uh, to grind through this stuff. Yeah, I am kind of curious as to what they're doing with the lumber. Unless they're just using it for firewood. Oh, something else I can talk about. Um, last week, uh, on top of the really good news about the uh, uh, marriage equality and all that stuff, it was also E3. Good news, uh, Final Fantasy VII is getting an actual remake. Uh, not just like an HD remake, but they're actually... I guess they're going back to uh, like a complete overhaul. Uh, like new, uh, new graphics completely, uh, new story elements. Uh, I think it's probably going to be... <clears throat> Excuse me. Probably the same story overall, um, but they uh, they said it's definitely not going to be exactly the same game. And I don't. I really wouldn't want them to do that. Um, I know people are screaming for you know, you know they want like the same game just with better graphics. Um, but I can see Square uh, Enix's. point of, you know, they're, because they had said before that they're not going to do uh, just like a, a remake just to pretty it up, uh, even though they've kind of done that with other games. Uh, I know they did it with uh, <clears throat> Final Fantasy 3, uh, not Final Fantasy 6, the one that was here, but like the actual Final Fantasy 3. Um, and uh, some of the other games, like they, they went in, and uh, like Final Fantasy. Oh gosh, I want to say Final Fantasy. Five? Ugh, I can't remember. It's It's been a while since I've played all of those. Uh, but they went in and they did, you know, more uh, 3D kind of uh, graphics and stuff like that, so. Um, I mean, they, they could definitely do it Hello. if they wanted to. But you know that nostalgia so, uh, is just, uh, it's well a powerful met. thing. Uh, and it'll make you think that you want you something. Around. And, uh, yay, revered with my guild. Um, <clears throat> it'll make you think that you want something, um, but it's never going to be exactly how you imagine it. Because your imagination is, you know, it can make you uh, kind of look at things in the... Uh, in ways that are not uh, realistic, I guess. So, I mean, if they go in and, uh, you know, change, you know, if they say, you know, this is what Final Fantasy VII should have been, and they clean up, like, some of the, the dialogue and make some of the um, plot points a little clearer, because there was... There was a lot of stuff in that game that was not exactly um, spelled out very well. Um, I mean, and if you haven't played it by now, I mean, seriously, you're doing yourself a really big disservice. Um, I wouldn't say it's my favorite Final Fantasy game, uh, but it's up there. It's, uh, 
Uh, I mean, I definitely played the crap out of it uh, whenever I was uh, probably in my 20s. Uh, but my favorite probably is uh, Final Fantasy VI but, you know, with Terra and Celis and Locke and all that. So. Finally, you're here. Get to work. My men have been sparring with these wooden practice dummies for far too long. Sure, you can learn how to swing a sword by practicing with the dummy, but real combat requires a real combatant. Hmm, I'd ask for them to send me someone imposing, but I suppose a skinny armed blood elf warlock will have to do. Right, challenge and defeat seven training. For the alliance. <clears throat> Excuse me. Martin uh, Hold Keep. Lord Tyrion Fordring with Ash. The time of the Argent Crusade is now. Mm, he is such a badass. Fleen, it is truly a pleasure. I know you are young and still training, but I've had my eye on you. We among the Argent Crusade are always looking for promising new recruits. You have indeed shown great promise. I have no immediately ugh, have no immediate task for you, but merely wish to meet you in person and see for myself what type of blood elf you really are. Were. For the time being, the amenities of Hearth Glen are yours to enjoy. I look forward to our next meeting. End of the scourge draws near. I don't know about the end of the scourge. Alright, then these these guys come up when you do this. I guess they're like, hey, we've got quests for you. You need something? The long trip home. I've been many places in my life, good warlock. I fought the battle for Ancourage, passed through the dark portal into Outland, and joined the Argent Crusade to beat down Scourge and Coldest Northrend. But before it all, I was a farmer here in Lordaeron. Now I find myself here in Hearth Glen, a scant few miles from home. It's time I paid my respects. I'm headed to the Mender's Dead before I return home. I wouldn't mind meeting up with Have you. Have a good one. Ah. Can I help you? Meeting up with you again once I get there. Be careful. Darla Lorraine. Lorraine. Daria Lorraine. Greetings. How do you do? My name is Daria. I'm one of the priests in charge of preserving the peace here in Hearthland. Sorry about that. I had uh, I wanted to change my music. Uh, I like the Mar the uh, Ave Maria from uh, uh, Final Fantasy uh, VI, but that version is quite loud, and I didn't want to listen to it. So we're listening to Deliverance of the Heart now from the uh, Summoning of the Spirit soundtrack. Anyway, uh, okay. I am one of the priests in charge of. Uh, in charge of preserving the peace here in Hearth Glen. One of my duties involves maintaining the tower down the trail to the southeast of Hearth Glen. This particular tower is of personal importance to the High Lord. It's the place where his son was killed. In the recent incursion of Knowles, however, maintenance of the tower has grown difficult. Will you help me rid the, tr the trail of some of the Knoll vandals I see? I, so I can do my duty. Yeah. Uh oh, did I? Oh, I disconnected. Hang on. 